What's up guys and welcome to my channel. On this video I want to show you a trilogy of um, White Snake um, collection of um, red, white and blues. I wait until I bought all of them so I can show you out of once. So let's start with the first one, the rock album. Um, actually, my son Robin he made me buy these he has it on a cd and when i checked it i just said maybe i should have it too on vinyl of course look look at this cover they are beautiful embossed everything very expensive but it's worth it to have if you are a white snake fan you have some um Pictures, uh, track listing is there. And you have some information. I am expecting any day now to come um, Restless Heart as a box set and vinyls. As soon as that arrive, I will make a video of that one too. I have to um, confess something. I after after this album i in some kind of way i was not so happy with white snake he tried to copy uh, very much 1987 mm, so so but still when um when rest the sound came later i was just uh, couldn't understand it was uh, not my cup of tea but I can't wait to give it a new listen when um, the box set arrives. This was a European version and this is from, um, I think it was from Japan or some other special countries. My son has that one. It's very cool, uh, cool um, album cover. I remember I do have his solo album, uh, Into the Light, but these others here are really not my cup of tea. Um, good to be bad, forevermore, and flesh and blood. I I am more into the eighties. Uh, White Snake. The thing with David Cordell, he always reinvented the band. But this uh, this new thing, it's not not exactly mine. So this is white vinyl. It's fantastic. And you have a truck. They are released in Rhino, which they did a very good job. It's 180 gram. I just um it has also a lyric sheet here. And also, I, I bought these collections because I I don't have these um, uh, Forevermore and uh, Flesh and Blood and um, Good to Be Bad. I know I just it's not my cup of tea. It's just it's a different white snake, not the one I like. This was quite good. It had some few good uh, songs, but um, yeah, the. the uh, hair metal band or poodle rock or whatever they call it was over during that time so that's why for me it was important to have because there are some songs from those albums that i don't have and i'm never gonna have uh for, for example here still of the night obviously everybody loves it but when it starts best years tell me why money is downhill for me lover and a stranger Going up again. So a lot of lot of songs here uh, which I don't have. So that's why it was important to have this album, to have that part of White Snake too. So this is the rock album, and then came love songs, not to be confused with ballads, because um, uh, to be honest with you, every White Snake song is a love song lyrics and stuff so um it's very beautiful album cover look at this that's it you see that 
It's almost worth it to buy because of this cover. Some pictures of Ben, and it, and it, it looks beautiful black and white in, in this uh, red color here. Uh, White Snake is never gonna be better album than 1987. That's that's how it is. Sadly, two egos of John Sykes and um, David Cordell they couldn't work together more. Let me see. There we have. Oh, so beautiful. Ah. I also have many, many other vinyls from White Snake. I will put the link below so you can check those videos and the box sets videos. Oh yeah, the red sheet here. So this is Love Songs, fantastic album cover, and and it's good, good. I shall I say this collage of the songs here and there. Uh, by the way, the songs are not taken directly from other albums and just put here. You can hear some differences because these albums are uh, revisited, remastered, and and then so so, so it's, it's very. Uh, I um, recommend this to um, every White Snake um, fan. The last one was the Blues album. So okay. We have a track lesson there. Sliding in, what a great record is that one. Uh, this is hard with a uh, uh, reworked cover. I'm eagerly waiting to see what is done with that one. I think he did do some songs twice in some kind of way. Too many tears. I, I didn't see any difference. That's hilarious. But shit, that's very good. I didn't see any difference from this song, Too Many Tears, which he released it in. Um, I believe he had it uh, on the two on rest is hard and uh, into the light maybe maybe small but i don't think it was that important song to do it um they say on on this one uh, i think is on a rock album too if i'm not mistaken uh, da, 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 da. Uh, no it's not here I think this must be on a love song, yeah. Too many tears is here too, yeah. So I don't see any difference, but it's fine. It's okay to have. All right, guys. So there you go, trilogy, white snake. Please like, subscribe. Let me know what you think. Until next time, take care. Bye.